Hello everyone, thank you for joining Remote Sensing and GIS question and answer session series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to prepare land surface temperature map using QGIS. So you can able to automatically extract the land surface temperature using the QGIS. So how to do that? That we'll see there are many demands regarding to prepare the land surface temperature using QGIS. So first we need to install these plugins. Okay, that is RS and GIS plugins is there that we need to install. For that we need to go to plugins and manage and install plugins here we need to install these plugins that is rs and js once you will search here rs and js you will see these plugins so just select it and install this so after installing these plugins i have already installed here okay after installing these plugins you will see these tools are here okay this is the small i will just shift it here so this is the small plugins if you'll see here okay so just click on this and you will see there are option is there okay they are saying the compress file or select the file mode option is there so we need to select this compress files okay so once you will select the compress files here you need to go to browser once we'll click on the browse option you will see the file is there okay so this file is mostly Landsat 8. Okay, if you'll go to Google, there is an option that is a Landsat collection one level one is there. Okay, this data set we need to use for this to prepare a, our land surface temperature. This is the Landsat 8 OLI data I'm using. So once I will go to QGIS, you will see here, this file we need to select and just click on open. Okay, so you will see here what files we can use. So these are the supported files like we can use list 3, list 4 they are showing, list 4 and list 3. Also we can use Landsat 8 OLI that is a sensor level 1 data and Landsat 7 this data set we can use. After this we need to select the compress file okay we have selected the compress file. After selection the compress file we need to select this ignore data okay also for Landsat 8 data extract feature and this cloud we are selecting and I'm interested to prepare the LST so I will select the LST after that if you want to prepare NDVI or NDWI whatever you want to prepare you need to select it okay also if you want uh, add sensor at satellite temperature also if you want in Celsius that also you can able to select so all the information is given here okay whatever you want to prepare so they are selling if you are interested to prepare land surface temperature just select a land surface temperature and after that we just need to click on the process start processing okay once we'll click on the start processing you will see one file is created here okay in the folder if you'll go back you will see this file is previously there dot tir file and along with that you will see this file is created here one output file will add here after completing the process still it is in process okay so from that we'll get this all the ndvi ndwi that lst so this lst all the information you will when you will come down now the process is completed you will see the output file we are getting here okay so in the output file so it is saying the process is completed so ready to go again okay just click on the output option and this landsat 8 and you will see whatever we have selected the we are getting the brightness temperature then we are getting brightness temperature 10 then also we are getting this uh lst for band 10 lst for band 11 then ndvi ndwi whatever we have selected we are getting so i'll just copy this and I will go to QGIS, then I will go to layer, okay, add layer, add raster layer, here I will select it, I will paste the link here, and all this file like I want to see the LST, or suppose I want to see all, I just select it, add, and close, okay, so this is the NDVI, and here is the LST for band 10, okay so just right click go to properties you can create a pseudo color 
just apply okay so this is the lst this is for ndvi ndwi right click go to properties so apply okay so this way you can able to get the ndvi ndwi all the information you will get here okay so if you require any help okay so you can inform us okay in continuous or equal interval if you want to do you can do that then apply and okay so you can able to see we have prepared ndvi ndwa all the information we can able to get so just need to but this only supported file format they are allowing okay here it will come up this only the supporting files they are allowing only okay so if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment sections thank you